that's right. <laughs> I can't. I'm not doing the intro anymore. <laughs> um, this is the first time I've been doing an intro on this, and I completely forgot. <laughs> like, I had to think for a moment, and then I realized, oh, hey, I'm not doing the intro anymore. Uh, let me take this off, because I think it'll be best for you guys to see my face. What is up? Now, this is another Minecraft update review, and this is going to be something a bit different, guys. This is going to be a graphics slash uh, update review, because I'm going to actually add in this, because I mean to, and I wasn't, and this was prepared early, because it just downloaded uh, today, and I wanted to actually give it a fresh look at it. Now, um, the menu has definitely changed. Um, I'm hoping it definitely changed, because a lot has happened with this game, and I think it's time we do talk about it. So, um, throughout the time, uh, they pretty much updated everything uh, as far as um, updates have been concerned. Uh, graphics, uh, they got some new stuff that they just added, and pretty much it's going to be an interesting uh, thing, because um, we got a lot to cover. So, uh, before we do uh, anything, I just wanted to let you guys know that uh, the next episode for um, Sniper Elite 4 will be definitely uh, coming out after this um, update, because this is going to be like a short update, and I don't want to end up like literally wasting my time trying to get over this, so <laughs> just remember that. Anyway, let's just get straight on task, and let's just get into this. So I'm going to see if I can do a recording on the uh, first thing that's going to happen, because um, I'm not going to do it now, because I refuse, but basically they changed the menu completely, and it's ridiculous how you have so many things in here and it becomes a society where we're going to literally need that because once we do, it's going to be one heck of a ride. And then they also added in the new cute mob into this. And we all know what it is. It is the bee. And um, they also added something quite surprising. And uh, I'll get that get to that in a minute. I'll get to that in a minute. But let's focus on one thing. Let's focus on one thing. So the menu is a bit changeable. So you got to sign into your... Um, Microsoft account. I did because I wanted to. I don't give a shit. And second, um, you don't have to. So, but basically, they will give you tokens and stuff, which is hilarious to me. Which I wasn't surprised that Microsoft is going to literally let you pay for every fucking thing. That's not a fucking surprise to me at all. But when prior to them, that's just them. So I'm not surprised. But um, they also added in a couple mobs that I didn't see before, which is kind of odd, because you never really see these mobs around here now, and it's kind of weird. Um, but basically, they do add in uh, particular mobs I'm going to get into in a minute. But first, let's get into this. Guys, they finally... Just, just hang on a second. Look at this. They finally added this. I was waiting... For somebody to do this, man. Now. I. Just. The reason I added my keyboard in here. Is because of this. This was why. So. Let me change this real quick. Because I think. Need to put this on. So. Oh. My bad. I meant to, I meant to click send. There we go. So it is going to be always day, so I just wanted to make sure that uh, I put that in there because I don't want to end up having mobs coming after me. And I'm in survival mode, so she probably could have actually gave myself some food <laughs> when I was doing this. Hang on a second. All right, so um, they added also some coordinates on here so you can show your own coordinates where you're at. It's easier because you don't know where the hell you are on the map, and it's hard to literally read them, and you have no clue on where exactly your home is. So, good thing they added that. So, props to them for putting that in. Now, also, they decided to add something that was kind of interesting to me. And it kind of got to me a little bit that I was willing to just check out before we even uh, got through. But basically, they added in the, the recipe book. And it's actually really nice. I want to actually test it with uh, the uh, crafting table. So, give me a minute because I'm going to... Uh, set this up real quick and hopefully anyone anyone would have noticed um, so I'm gonna change it up to Because uh, I want to make sure I do that so it's gonna be Oh, yep, yeah, I forgot I need that 
I need to go strictly on there too, because they won't let me do anything else. Um, flash game. Mode. Mode C, I think. Yep. And yeah. Oh yeah. Square is the square is the send you. Square is the send. You fucking moron. God damn it. It it's hard to deal with, but whatever, man. This is the first time I've used this, so do not judge me. You damn it. My bad. There we go. All right, so I had to change it up cuz I didn't want to do that, but basically, um I'm editing that out. I'm editing that out. So basically, we uh, have a bit of a show to show you guys for this one cuz I didn't think this was going to be a thing that we needed to do, but whatever. Um, but we'll deal with that in a bit. Um, so let's get to the crafting situation. So I got the crafting table, right? So let me place it. And when you look into it, guys, watch this. Because I think this is something that a lot of people are going to literally not remember in this situation where we have a ton of um, certain things uh, going on. And when this stuff goes, is, is a GM? Oh, you can't do GM anymore. I think they're not gonna do it. Do it prior to the fact, but whatever. Um, so when they first uh, put this on release, and I wanted to make sure this was something that a lot of people were going to focus on. I didn't notice that this was going to be released based off the situation, so I was kind of concerned. But basically, look at this. Crafting is in in stock at this point you can now look at the recipe book for this you don't need to go and look at uh the other mode and all that shit you finally can actually um craft stuff on here and it's actually cool so um so as soon as you have the crafting stuff you can literally just take it out of there and it's actually something that it's really useful and it's awesome and i love it so once they add it in here, it's going to be one of the best things that they've ever added on here. Uh, so, Locator's Map is in here, too, because apparently... So, there's something... So, I don't know what this is about. I've never seen this yet. So, I'm kind of interested to see what exactly they uh, have in store for everybody. But, they also added something that they took five years to fucking do. You know what that is? You know what that is? Let me present to you, ladies and gentlemen, the command block. <laughs> they finally released this, son of a bitch. I have been waiting five fucking years for this shit. I have been waiting. <laughs> I have been waiting for this way too long. <laughs> and we all know what the command block does, everybody. This shit is going to be lit. <laughs> and the thing is... We all know what this baby does, and it's going to be one of the best thing prior to the Minecraft 2013-2014 era. It is going to be insane. And let me tell you, I'm going to be very excited to do my own servers and probably get my own maps. Because if I'm going to be doing this, and if I'm thinking about this, there's a slight chance that S&P might be coming on to Minecraft P PlayStation Edition, guys. So, if there's going to be a Minecraft SMP series, I am going to be doing it. And I'm going to be including my friends on this. Because once they get into this, it's going to be one hell of a show. And, guys, keep in mind, I've been on um, YouTube since 2013. And this stuff is surprising me that they took five years to fucking do. So, it's not a surprise that these guys were going to be like that. So, whatever. Um, but anyways, let's get on to um, the next thing that we have, which is the bees. Now, the bees, on the other hand, they finally added these motherfuckers in here, and it's actually amazing. I love these little guys, and I have, haven't got to see them yet. Uh, let me eat before we start spawning them in. Uh, it's going to be amazing, and, hope, and they are neutral, so if you do attack them, they are going to attack you. But if... But if they don't, that then just don't attack them at all. 
Hi. Look at this cute little thing, man. Look at this cute little thing. That is adorable. That is adorable. God, Jesus. And they also have prior to this, they have the beehive. They have the bee's nest honeycomb in a honeycomb block with the honey, honey bottom, uh, bottom, <laughs> bottom, the honey bottom. <laughs> but Bonita honey bottom, <laughs> but my bad. Um, but basically, um, we have a lot to cover. Basically, they also have the beehive, which is actually re really nice to use. And uh, prior to that, they also have the bee beehive here, which is actually actually their home. And the bees are very, very friendly. So don't try to just literally kill them because that's not them. Um, and there's the honey block, which is actually something that people can consume every now and then. And it's hilarious because you have a ton of them that will probably go into the field, will go for flowers and pollen. And it's just the same process as real life. So it's really awesome to come up with anything like this in any type of generation because you have to think about like how long it took them to put this shit up because five years in prior to what they've done throughout the past few years is really difficult and the blocks on here are actually probably easier to make uh, if you just find them like literally if you just find these things like uh so for example like the honey block and all that shit it's not that hard to make the thing is like you like for example if you go into the crafting table right and if you try to find the um the honey block literally it, it it's that simple literally it's that simple four bottles and four fuck fucking honeycombs it's not that hard man come on four fucking honeycombs i can do that in my lightweight i can do that in my heavyweight i can do that in my featherweight it is too easy, G. You pretty much don't really need the recipe book if you already know the recipes on here, on the game. But if you do, then the recipe book is definitely your uh, type of style. So. so, let's also get in with the most important ones in here. Oh, and I also forgot to mention, they have these little baby things. This is a turtle, the sea turtle egg. And I didn't think they can actually have this, so... Breeding on here might be interesting. I, 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 I might I might be interested. I might be interested. So you never know. You never know. But um let's not focus on that. Let's focus on the fox and the panda and oh my god. Is that thunder? <sighs> Give me a minute. So I just had to make sure the man's cause my dog was annoying me. But let's not get to that, please. Let's not get to that. Let's focus on these. So we got the panda. Oh, how adorable! How adorable! Look at this guy. He's so adorable. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> now, um, we also have the fox. Now, I don't know if they attack you by any chance, so there's a prior chance I might have to run. But here we go. Three, two. One. Oh! <laughs> they don't attack you at all! Look at that wagon! Oh my god, this is so adorable! Oh my goodness! This is all adorable, guys. You have to understand how very much adorable this is. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness. I, I, think, I, I think I might as well end it here with the adorableness. This is amazing, guys. This really is. But um, I'm probably just going to put the tutorial of the um, the beginning um, probably at uh, the probably at the end. So that way you guys could see um, what you're going to be seeing. But uh, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Also, make sure you leave a like because I do be paying attention to my comments and pay attention to my video resume and the results. So, I will be paying attention to all that. So, prior to... <gasps> that is adorable! Oh my god! Okay. I'm probably... I'm, I swear to god, I'm getting too quiet for this. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys next time. Say bye, little panda! Bye!
All right, guys. So this is the front screen. Front, <laughs> front screen. I can't read. Great. <laughs> uh, this is the front screen, and look at that, guys. They have updated so much on this damn thing, and let me tell you, I am interested. Now, prior to everything else that what happened, um, according to uh, anything, um, oh. Oh, I've, I've just noticed that my bad <laughs> so as you guys can see provoked clown 43 that is my Microsoft account and they also give you a profile that you can either customize your skin or maybe maybe you go back to your current skin I got the gorilla in here obviously now take a look at Alex's eyes for one moment just 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 look at it yep 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 you guys see that right you guys see that right there is a Freaking, and I swear to God, I hate this so much. They literally have the characters blinking. <laughs> they have the characters blinking, and it's really creepy. But at the same time, I, I'm used to it. I don't really care. So prior to that, um, let's focus on a few things. So you can customize your skin. You can customize everything. It's Everything's pretty much going on for Christmas. Uh, so that's not a surprise. So these are featured skins. So, um, what we're going to do is we're going to edit the character, character, uh, model. And if you look at it, it shows the body and them blinking again. God damn it. That is hilarious. Um, so let's focus on the top. So the top is a bit of a stretch, if you can see. Um, so if you can, you can literally change anything and it's hilarious. So you can literally change this to anything. It's kind of cool. So Pretty much you could customize your own skin and it literally gets into the game. I'm probably going to customize after this, but uh, because I'm probably not going to deal with like, um, I'm probably not going to let um, me deal with the gorilla for so long because I want to make sure I also customize them as well, which is something that I'm prioring to do. So, uh, but basically you have these, this stuff up here that literally lets you like edit and literally go through everything. And you, and like I said, you have to pay for tokens in order to go through it's like six bucks, but I'm pretty sure not that many people has it, but whatever. Um, but prior to that, that's pretty much how much money you just have to buy just for that. Because they literally have a bonus of 60 coins, but that's pretty much 16 tokens. My bad. <laughs> 16 coins. I'm thinking of uh, something else. But six. prior to that, they do have that. So just make sure you guys check the store and you can go ahead and look at it. Um, but anyway, other than that, uh, they also have bottoms, headgear, outlet. Outfits, headgear, everything else. So the back items are gonna gonna be interesting prior to that. So um, they also gonna add in the featured ones, which I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be awesome. So I'm gonna be interested to literally see what they have in store. Um, but back items and the face items, on the other hand, they actually might have stuff that's available. So I'm gonna take a good look at it and see see if there's anything you have to do now. There are some things you have to be careful of because if you just buy the wrong things and then spend all this money, you have to be careful on it. But whatever. That's prior to you if you want to actually do that. So I'm not even being concerned uh, prior to what you do and what happens with you. But um, <clears throat> if anything, that's pretty much how you literally like uh, get the old skin in. Like, you have some certain skins that you own, but if you want to just change the body and style, and for example, if you want... You want to change the style of this you can literally change like one of the old old purchable ones and it'll be fair so um prior to that i'm i'm going to probably just literally like get back on this one but um anyways that's pretty much what you'll expect in this situation so the playstation store definitely has a lot of stuff involved especially what's happening in store so uh, tokens are unique. You can actually buy oh skin packs. So I'm guessing what the um, What the tokens are going to be used for and and what I'm guessing in this point is yep yeah, right here That's what I was expecting. So you could use the tokens to actually get um, Certain maps. I'm guessing this is probably maps um, So they have a lot of decent maps adventure time and I'm probably gonna get that because that's actually look hella nice and they also have uh, Kingdom Craft, uh, Infinite Skyblock, which actually, that's something that I might actually get into as a review 
Um, tell me in the comments if you guys want me to actually do that as a review. I'll literally probably do it. I'll probably do it, uh, depending on the situation. But, um, pretty much they also have skin packs in here that actually, uh, helps out with anything else. So, um, all skin packs, including the classic Star Wars. Uh, they also have certain ones based on the Incredibles. They have most of the ones that are based around Minecraft, but we're not going to get into that now, are we? Um, they also have the classic ones, we already know, and prior to everything else, they literally have everything in store as far as what we were expecting um, from the game, like, <laughs> like five years back. So, and then they also have Magic the Gathering, which I didn't think they had, my Morphin Power Rangers. They probably added those in late, um, into the years. I probably didn't look at it, because I wasn't sure if they actually added this in, so please understand. Um, so they have a lot, Fantasy Five. they've even added a lot of stuff in here. So, pretty much anything that literally, like, touches the surface. And Storm Tracers, I think I've seen that before. Cool anime. Uh, I'm definitely touching that. Yeah. Take it if you will. And they also added gods in here? Huh. Prior to that, that's actually interesting. They also have the spooky legends. I'm guessing they have, in my guessing, they're probably having a, a, a slender and, a, oh, yep. <laughs> oh, isn't that Eyeless Jack? I just realized something. Wait, oh no, that's a hat man. That's a hat man, goat man. Goat man. Oh, yep, the Cobra. Bunny man and Red, oh, Red Mary. Uh, we're not, that, that's not her name, by the way. <laughs> but we're not gonna talk about it. Um, and there's the Mark Slender that we all know, and the Nightmare Scientist. Nightmare Scientist and the Hookman. Oh, yeah, the Hookman. I, I'm surprised they literally didn't add, like, the other ones. Like, there's other, uh, other ones that we actually have in here. Now, they also have Worlds, Texture Packs, and Mashup Packs. Now, the Worlds, it seems like they definitely, prior to anything else, they probably have some adventure. I was about to say, they probably have some adventure maps. Frozen. Frozen mech suits. They have, they definitely have stuff in here that's probably in store for like survival spawns, mini games, anything. Cause they, they literally decided to add all this, and there's no way in hell they weren't gonna add on this and then decide, oh, we're not, we're not gonna release a full display of maps once we add it in the command block. <laughs> like literally, there's no way in hell they weren't going to do that. And uh, extreme survival wasteland. Now. This one, I'm guessing, I'm gonna probably do a survival on this. Maybe, depending on the situation. If anyone wants me to do survivals in here, let me know in the comments, cause I'm gonna be saving up my uh, stuff for the, oh, lucky block, sky block. That is funny. Um, if they had like anything prior to that, I'm gonna be laughing. Uh, Living luxury updated, which is actually interesting how they added those in. Uh, but other than that, us, uh, ooh, oh! Oh, I might actually play that too. My God, they got maps that I can actually do. I I'm probably going to do that as a series. So be ready for that, guys. Be ready for that. I'm going to be probably doing that for the next, for my next series. If, th if this is the one thing I'm going to be doing, I am going to make sure that this goes up. I'm going to make sure. Um, but anyways, um, that's pretty much it as far as anything else, like texture pack wise, anything else. Yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, but before you go, there's a lot of things that I have to talk about when it comes to settings. They have changed a lot in the settings uh, that I meant to speak up on. The FOB. They changed it, changed it for FOB, so make sure you guys go check that out because that's going to be interesting to you. And also, they changed up a few things far as um, society-wise because they actually had to put everything in here in accessibility. Uh, text to speech for chat was actually actually one thing I meant I meant to also put in with all um, but I'm not gonna do that um, And they also give you like uh, some global packs you could actually use so that's gonna be interesting prior to Minecraft in the future So that has been amazing <laughs> Anyways, I'm out guys later